It's a dream to have something that's just so, it's, it's a stylish home. I don't know anybody who builds a house and doesn't come and want to have a look at their property and take a photo of every stage. I mean, again, we have the photo of us doing this when we bought the block. We have a photo of that when the portaloo goes up, you know what I mean? Debbie had really done her thinking about the place and come up with the idea that she liked the mid-century look and feel. And, uh, and then we sort of gave that to Alex, who then turned it into this, this great idea. And, um, and then, you know, it was pretty exciting seeing those first set of plans. He presented us with two plans, um, and but straight away I was drawn to this one because it's still the outside. I really wanted it to be blending into the environment. I didn't want it to be um, noticeable almost, which I think if when you look across the road, you can just see our house. And that's what I like. I like it fitting into the environs and um, just kind of fading into that. Yeah, Alex sure. is a very nice person, he's very hands-on and uh, just did a great job in pulling this uh, design together for us like he did. I was just very impressed at the end with how well built the house was and st sturdy, you know, lots of uh, yeah, steel involved and, and got a lot more comfortable that this, this place wasn't going to blow away in the first wind, you know. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, for me it is the dream home, yeah. We don't plan to move again as long as we're healthy enough to live here, we'll stay here. but. Um, yeah, yeah, I just feel so fortunate that uh, we're able to sort of live here um, until they take us out in the pine box. <laughs> With a bit of luck and hopefully it's a few years away, yeah.